Khalid Mishal, Hamas political bureau chief, held talks with a European delegation of British politicians in Damascus to discuss the Palestinian reconciliation talks and reconstruction of Gaza Strip. At a press conference after the meeting, Claire Short, a member of the British Labour Party, said the delegation's meeting with Hamas leaders aims to urge the British government to talk to Hamas in the interests of peace. There must be a just settlement to the suffering of the Palestinians, that it's a cause of... It's immoral and it's destabilizing the world. The purpose of the visit is to try and work towards a peace and a settlement between, for the Palestinians, a just peace. Analysts believe that until Hamas is directly involved in international talks on the Middle East conflict, no settlement is possible. This delegation's visit is to affirm the importance of communicating with the Hamas movement as an important and necessary step for reaching a real understanding of any genuine settlement in the region. That is the only way we can gradually force our governments to recognize that you have to talk to Hamas, which is one of the main parties in what's going on. British Member of Parliament urged global pressure on Israel to make it comply with international law. Israel has shown uh, in the recent war on the Palestinian people that uh, international law is for the little people and the little people are subjected to rules which clearly Israel uh, don't feel that they have to abide, b abide by. Osama Hamdan, representative of the Hamas Palestinian movement in Lebanon, called on all Palestinian factions to engage in a constructive dialogue, especially after the Israeli elections and the changes that the American administration has lately witnessed. It is widely believed that the European parliamentarian's visit reflects the European Union's recognition that there won't be any kind of settlement between Israel and the Palestinians without engaging the Hamas movement as it is the democratically elected government of the Palestinians. Samer Dada, Press TV, Damascus.